Welcome to our Time for Adventures Diecast Monster Truck Racing and Reveals. Hello viewers and welcome back to another Diecast Monster Truck Bracket Racing Tournament here at our Replica Track. Before we get started today, we want to talk about the track a little bit. We have had a lot of comments and speculation lately that Series 8 continues winning these races because the blue lane is faster than the red lane of our track. So what we are going to do today is Series 8, the returning champions, will be racing out of the red lane to see if there is any truth to this. Do you think Series 8 will continue to win or will the newcomers in the blue lane take the victory here today we will find out shortly but first let's meet the 14 time returning champions series number eight spin master monster jam trucks starting with blue thunder then we have cyclops sparkle smash overcast el toro loco Nitro Neon Son of a Digger, Inverse Grave Digger, Radical Rescue, and Whiplash. And again, these returning champions today will be racing out of the red side of the track. Let's see how they can do. Now, here's a look at what the trucks see coming down those lanes. Whoa, it's a big ramp, huge jump, and there's the crush cars. But now, let's head back over to the pits and meet today's new competitors. Spinmaster Monster Jam Series number 22, starting with Lumberjack, the awesome Hyperfuel Grave Digger, Max D, Grave Digger the Legend, Black El Toro Loco, Storm Damage, Inverse Megalodon, and Monster Mutt. Some of these trucks in this new Series 22 have been extremely fast in some of our YouTube short videos, but how will they stack up against returning champs? We'll find out soon, but first let's take a look at the bracket and how the races will lay out. For today's tournament, we will have Lumberjack facing Blue Thunder, Hyperfuel Gravedigger will race Cyclops, Max D will be taking on Sparkle Smash. Grave Digger the Legend will face Overcast El Toro Loco. Black El Toro Loco will be taking on Nitro Neon Son of a Digger. Storm Damage will race Inverse Grave Digger. Max Contrast Megalodon will be taking on Radical Rescue. And finally, Monster Mutt will be facing against Whiplash. There are some great matchups in this tournament here today. What do you say we head up to the gates and get the races started? All right, here we go with race number one. We will have Lumberjack in the blue lane, taking on Blue Thunder in the red lane. Let's go racing. Both trucks side by side coming into the jump. Lumberjack has a huge jump. Both crashes. Lumberjack makes it to the line first. Wow, that blue lane is really fast. Sorry, Blue Thunder. Let's take another look. Coming down the ramp, both trucks are wheel to wheel coming into the jump. Big air. Blue Thunder's just slower. Lumberjack crashes, flips over, and takes the win with the back end. What a race. Well, with the first race out of the gate, it is the newcomer in the blue lane, Lumberjack, taking the win, moving into the second round. Maybe this new Series 22 has something to prove here today against these 14-time champs. Let's head back up to the gates where the next pair is lined up and ready to go and see what they got. And up next, we have the Hyperfuel Gravedigger in the blue lane, taking on Cyclops in the red lane. Let's go racing! The green flies, here we go, oh, Cyclops so fast, coming into the jump, big air to the crush cars, jumps the crush cars, wow, what a smooth, fast run from that returning champion, that was awesome, Cyclops moving into the next round, let's take another look. As the green flag drops, both trucks quick coming down the ramp, but Cyclops starts to pull away by about a truck length, lands, jumps the crush cars into wheelie and takes the win, that was so fast. Well, viewers, that right there is the reason this Cyclops is returning champion. That run and that truck was so fast. And it is Cyclops taking the win, moving into the next round, eliminating Gravedigger. Let's head back up to the gates where the next pair is lined up and waiting for us to go. And next up to the line, we have Max T in the blue lane. Taking on Sparkle Smash in the red lane. Here we go. The gate drops and Max D have bumps coming down the ramp. Sparkle Smash takes the lead. Oh, has a big crash over the finish line, but doesn't matter because Max D doesn't even make it there. Wow. Let's take another look from the track cam, see what happened. Max D starts bouncing around the lanes, coming down, slows up. Sparkle Smash with a huge jump. Max D goes right, can't hold it. Sparkle Smash flips over the line to take the win. What a race. 
There must have been something broke in the front of that Max D truck because it lands and just shoots into the other lane. Huge crash. But it doesn't matter because Sparkle Smash was so far ahead flipping across the finish line to take the win and we'll move on. Let's head back up to the starting gate for the next pair now. For this matchup, we have Gravedigger the Legend in the blue lane. Taking on over Castel Toro Loco in the red lane. Let's go racing. Gravedigger pulling away, coming into the jump. Big arrow, hard landing, can't hold it. El Toro Loco passes over the obstacles. Wow, what just happened? El Toro Loco with a big wheelie there at the end. But let's take another look at that last minute pass. Coming down the ramp from the green flag. Gravedigger starts to pull away, has a huge jump away ahead. Can't hold the landing, crashes on the obstacles. And El Toro Loco just goes flying by. What a race that was. Gravedigger the legend had a huge lead and gave it away, not sticking that landing. It is over Castel Toro Loco, taking the win, moving into the second round. What a race. But let's head back up to the gates and see what the next pair has in store. And for this race, we have the Black El Toro Loco racing out of the blue lane, taking on Nitro Neon Son of a Digger in the red lane. Here we go. Son of a Digger ahead, coming into the jump, and El Toro Loco's quicker, starting to catch up over the crush cars at the line wall. It was so close. Which truck won? El Toro Loco with a huge crash into the wall. We need to take a look in slow-mo to see which truck it was taking the win. Coming down the ramp into the jump, Son of a Digger starts to pull away. They both have a good jump, land about the same time. El Toro Loco gets that speed over the crush cars at the line. It is El Toro Loco by a tire tread taking the win. Wow, Son of a Digger with a huge crash, but El Toro Loco got it. Definitely the closest race of the tournament so far right there. And by a tire tread, it is El Toro Loco taking the win to move on into the next round and join Team 8 Lumberjack. What a race. But let's head back up to the gates now, where of course we have two trucks lined up and ready to battle. For this matchup, we have Storm Damage racing out of the blue lane. Facing inverse Gravedigger in the red lane. Let's go racing. The green fly storm damage ahead coming into the jump. Oh wait, Gravedigger's catching up. Gravedigger has brought the storm damage. Passes again and takes the win. Wow, what a back and forth battle. Let's take another look from the track cam. Coming down the ramp. Storm damage starts to pull away just a little bit. But wait, Gravedigger catches up. Storm damage goes to the middle and flips over the line to pass for the win. Awesome. What a great matchup that one ended up being by two amazing trucks. But it is Storm Damage flipping across the line to take the win over Inverse Gravedigger. Sorry, Gravedigger, not today. Let's head back up to the gates and see which trucks will be joining them in the next race. All right, up now we have Max Contrast Megalodon in the blue lane. Taking on Radical Rescue in the red lane. Let's go racing. The green flies in there off. Oh, what happened to Radical Rescue? Where'd that power come from? So fast up over the crush cars for the win. Wow, where'd that speed come from in the red side? Let's take another look. As the gate drops, either Radical Rescue super fast or Max Contrast having a problem, but Radical Rescue way ahead. Smooth run over the line to take the win. What a race, that was so fast. Cyclops was so fast earlier in this race and now it's Radical Rescue in the red lane flying over those crush cars to take the win and move on into the next round. Those trucks are so fast here today. Let's head back up to the gates where the last pair for the first round's lined up and ready to rock. Oh yeah, here we go. We have the awesome Monster Mud in the blue lane. Taking on Whiplash in the red lane. Let's go racing. Here we go, Monster Mud ahead by about a truck coming off the jump, nice there. Oh, Monster Mud hits the center, slows up. Whiplash passes in a wheelie to take the win. Whoa, let's definitely look at that one again. As the green flies, Monster Mud is running down that track. Big jump heading to the center, but watch Whiplash in a wheelie across the line to pass at the last minute to take the win and move on, awesome. Another awesome battle here at the track in this tournament. Monster Mud almost had it, but Whiplash came storming back and takes the win in style with that wheelie across the line. That was awesome. Whiplash moving into the next round. But for now, let's head back over to the pits and check out the trucks that are moving on. Well, viewers, we really hope you're enjoying the racing here today where the returning champions are racing out of the red lane. There sure has been some great matchups so far, but unfortunately, half the trucks have been eliminated, but they sure look good sitting over here in the pits, don't they? Now, let's take a look at the trucks that are moving on into the next round, starting with Lumberjack and Sparkle Smash. Then we have Cyclops and Overcast El Toro Loco, the Black El Toro Loco and Radical Rescue, as well as Storm Damage and Whiplash. Let's head back up to the starting gate, get the races started, and see which of these eight trucks will be moving on. 
And up first for this round, we will have Lumberjack in the blue lane, taking on Sparkle Smash in the red lane. Let's go racing. Both trucks wheel to wheel coming into the jump. Nice jump, smooth over the crush cars at the line and so close. Whoa, wow. That was awesome. Let's take another look at slow-mo. Coming down the ramp, these trucks are side by side. Big air, smooth landing, and at the line it is. Oh, Lumberjack by a tire tread. That's gotta be the closest race we've had without being a tie. Awesome. Well, viewers, it doesn't get much closer than that. These trucks are putting on a great show here today, but it is Lumberjack taking the win, being the first truck to move into the semi-final round. What a race. Sorry, Sparkle Smash, we'll see you later. Let's head back up to the gates where the next pair is ready to go. And for this matchup, we have Cyclops in the blue lane, taking out Overcast Del Toro Loco in the red lane. Here we go. The green flies and they're off. Cyclops a little ahead coming into the jump. Big air. Oh, Toro Loco has problems. Not as quick of a run. Cyclops takes the win with a big jump at the end. Wow. Let's take another look from that track cam. As they launch, Cyclops just starts to pull away. El Toro Loco has a little hard landing, and Cyclops just blows over the crush cars to take the win as El Toro Loco goes flipping. What a race. Well, Cyclop isn't a multi-time champion for nothing. That truck is always fast, and now it's also moving into the semi-final round with Lumberjack. Let's head back up to the gates and see what other truck will be moving on. For your next battle, we have the Black El Toro Loco truck taking on the always fast Radical Rescue. Let's go racing. The green flies, the trucks are gone. Well, Radical Rescue's out of here like it's on its way to an emergency. Jumps the crush cars with ease all the way to the end of the track. Wow. Two races in a row, two El Toro Locos having problems. What is going on? Let's take another look. As the green flies, the gate drops. Radical Rescue pulls away by about a truck length. Smooth landing, El Toro Loco having problems. And it's no problem for Radical Rescue taking that win. What a race. Well, another second round race and another second round win for series number eight. Radical Rescue taking the win, moving into the semifinals with teammate Cyclops. Let's head back up to the gates and see which other trucks are going to be moving on. And here we are back at the line where we have Storm Damage taking on Whiplash. Let's go racing. Green flag flies, here we go. Whiplash with a huge hole shot coming down the ramp. Big jump, storm damage is just slow. What happened? Whiplash takes the win and then with a huge crash. But let's take another look and check out what happened to storm damage. As the green flies, Whiplash just so fast coming out of the gates. Watch that truck in the red lane. Big jump, smooth landing. Storm damage doesn't stand a chance as Whiplash goes flying across the line to take the win. Wow, those trucks are just so fast over there. Not sure what happened to that storm damage truck. We'll have to check with the crew later. But Whiplash takes the win in this one and we'll move into the semi-final round. That truck was really flying. Let's head back over to the pit area now and check on the trucks that are moving on into the semi-finals. We have had some absolutely incredible races here so far today on our replica track. There's been some big crashes, some close finishes, and even a little freestyle. Unfortunately, 12 trucks have already been eliminated from today's tournament, but these trucks still look awesome. Comment and let us know what your favorite truck is. But let's check out the trucks moving on. Going into the semi-final round, we will have Lumberjack and Radical Rescue, as well as Cyclops and Whiplash. This race is still up for grabs. Which truck will it be? Let's head back up to the gates and find out now. And up first to the starting line for the semis, we will have Lumberjack in the blue lane, taking on Radical Rescue in the red lane. Let's go racing. Green flag flies and Radical Rescue off to an early lead, coming into the jump, big air. Lumberjack so fast, oh, at the line, who was it? Did Lumberjack catch up or did Radical Rescue hold off for the win? Let's take another look. Coming down the ramp, Radical Rescue starts to pull away by about a tire coming off the jump, smooth landing, and it is, oh, it is Lumberjack at the line, taking the win, what a race, what a comeback. We sure have had some extremely close races here today, but that come from behind victory from Lumberjack. We'll put Lumberjack in the final round. Radical Rescue will have to race one more time for third place. That was awesome. Let's head back up to the starting gate for the next pair. All right, viewers, here we go. Semi-final number two. We have Cyclops taking on Whiplash. Let's go racing. Here we go, both trucks even coming into the jump, big air, smooth landing, both trucks even over the crush cars, even at the line, wow, that's another close race, what is going on here, let's take another look from the track cam in slow-mo, 
Here we go, the green flag flies. Both trucks are even coming down the ramp. Watch them both close. It's blue in the red lane, red in the blue lane, and at the line on is Cyclops taking the win. Wow, what an incredible couple races we've had here in the semifinals. I guess that's why those trucks are here. And with that one, it is Cyclops taking the win, moving into the final round. Whiplash will have to race one more time. So let's head back over to the pits and check out the trucks moving on to the finals. And we just want to say thank you to the viewers that have stuck around this long into the final round to check out these trucks. And racing for third place, we will have Radical Rescue and Whiplash. And for your final round and championship, we will have Lumberjack and Cyclops. Can the new Series 22 take the win or will Series 8 do it again? These races have always been great in the final round. Lumberjack is still here, so let's see what can happen. Cyclops is a returning champion, so will that truck win? Let's head up to the gates and find out now. And up first to the starting line as you race for third place, we will have Radical Rescue in the blue lane and Whiplash in the red lane. Let's go racing. Whiplash with the whole shot coming out of the gate into the jumping arrow. Starts having problems. Radical Rescue catching up at the line. It's a close race again. Wow. Radical Rescue to the end of the track. But let's take another look in slow-mo. Who won? As the flag drops, Whiplash starts pulling away. Huge jump from both trucks. Whiplash has problems. Radical Rescue passes for the win. Last second, wow! Two come from behind races from Radical Rescue. Radical Rescue had an awesome pass in that one and will take the win in third place here in this championship. What a race from Radical Rescue. Now let's head back up to the gates where the last two for the finals are ready to go. And here we are, viewers, the final round. We have Lumberjack in the blue lane from 22. Will we have a new champion? Or will it be Cyclops winning the multi-time returning champion? Let's go racing. Here we go, side by side into the jump. Oh, look at that air from Cyclops all the way to the crush cars. Jumps the crush cars with ease for the win. Wow. Jump the crush cars and Lumberjack was just coming off the obstacle. Let's take another look. Watch Cyclops in that red lane. Huge jump by about two truck lengths over Lumberjack. Takes the win with ease. What a race. Sorry, Lumberjack, you gave it a great shot, but that Series 8 Cyclops is multi-time returning champion for a reason. Wow. What an absolutely incredible show these 16 diecast monster trucks have put on here today. But there can only be one winner, and it is Cyclops once again taking the win here in this tournament and becoming champion. This has been absolutely incredible. That truck is so fast. What do you say we head over to the winner circle and check them out? Oh yeah, there they are, the fastest three trucks here today. They all deserve to be up there. This has been an absolutely incredible showing, and Lumberjack did great for Series 22. And today, up on that third place podium, we have the awesome Radical Rescue. Then we have that great looking Lumberjack truck, new from Series 22, up on that second place podium. Great job. And once again, here in our Monster Truck Tournament, we have Cyclops up there on that first place podium with that trophy. That truck is absolutely unstoppable. Series eight, can they be beat? You'll have to stick around for the next race to find out. But for now, let's help these trucks celebrate. Yeah.